Hello, and welcome to our beginner's guide to creating amazing photo mosaics. In this video series, we'll be going over how to create a project using our online mosaic tool. Although this is a beginner's guide, we will also be covering some advanced topics that you can use to take your mosaic project to the next level. Before we jump into things, the online mosaic tool is great for anyone looking to create a mosaic print, digital file, video, or an online collaborative and interactive activation. From personal projects to large corporate projects and everything in between, this tool can nearly do it all. If this is your first time using the tool, then you'll need to sign up. This is done in three easy steps by filling out your name, the email address you want to associate with the account, and a password. You can also register by connecting your Facebook or Google account. If you've already created an account, then you're just going to go ahead and log in using that information. This is your project page. Here, you can find all the projects you're working on, as well as starting a new project. You can see I have some previous projects that I've been working on, but for this tutorial, we're going to go ahead and start a new project. Starting off with a new project, you'll find yourself on the project homepage. On the left-hand side of the page, you will see our navigation panel. Here, you can quickly navigate through the simple steps in creating your mosaic project. At the top of the page here, you'll find some tabs that can be used to navigate through your account. Here you can access any of your projects, videos, or downloads associated with your account. If you're looking to embed a mosaic or have additional people add to your project, you're going to want to start a collaboration and interactive project. That can be done by navigating to this tab here. You can find a link to the video series covering how to do that in the description below. Wrapping up, as we go through this video series, we're going to be covering the different steps you need to complete over the course of your Mosaic project. The additional videos in this series will break down what customization options you have at each step and how to get the most out of your project. So stay tuned. 